to show you. Okay, I am completely. I am almost completely set with Shopkins. I'm gonna show you how to draw <laughs> one of my favorites right here. He's my favorite, Adam Apple. I want to show you how to draw him. You don't have to have the specific Shopkin, but I'm going to be drawing him. You can draw whatever Shopkin you want, but this is the one I'm going to be showing you how to draw. You need almost the entire rainbow of pencils to draw Shopkins. Um, but obviously you need one simple pencil. So let's start drawing. Okay, to draw Adam Apple, first we need to do basic shapes. So he looks like a circle figure, kind of. So... He looks like a circle, so we are going to do a light circle with your basic pencil. Do your best. I'm not even, I'm not even an experienced drawer. My parents say I'm really good, so I'm going to try to show you how to draw Adam Apple. So, first you just need a basic, just need a generic shape. And then he has two little oval feet sticking out, so we gotta make his feet. He kinda wants to walk around. I bet you do too, so just like make his light feet. Don't make it dark, so you can easily just erase it if you need to. Okay, there. There are his feet. He has little tiny stubby arms right next to his feet. So we'll make little tiny arms. Who doesn't love arms? And now to make his nose. His nose is around the middle of his face. And then he has a stem sticking out right here. And it's kind of curved this way. So I like do that. There. Then we got to make his leaves. He has one leaf sticking out. Wait, here. Kind of like that. He's got one leaf like that and then he has another leaf like this and then he kind of looks like a tomato <laughs> and then he's got another leaf back here that you can't really see if you're looking at him from front but I guess we can just do that there okay so that, those are his leaves and then we got to erase the things from the inside like this. Just little strokes. This is why you make light circles. So you can easily just erase if you need to. Everyone needs to erase. No one is perfect at this. No one's perfect. Okay. Once you got all the little lines erased, then you can start on his eyes. He's got circle eyes. You don't see the other one because it's covered up by the leaf. The little circle eyes, and then you got a smaller circle in here, and then even smaller one right here. Then you got a little eyelash, and then two more eyelashes down here. There. And just color, color those in. He looks really creepy to me. <laughs> there. Okay, and then we just color in the black spot. Like that. There. See, now he's got an eyeball. You can see where he's going. Now we just need a little, kind of like a comma swoosh for, a, for an eyebrow. Just do 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 do. Try not to make him look angry. I'm so bad at eyebrows. Okay, you got a nose. And then we got to add a smile. And he has a little tongue sticking out right there. So just got down. And then we stick his tongue out right there. There we go. We got a tongue. Boop. Split. Got a little split in the tongue. And then just keep on going with the smile. And now we just outline the rest with darker lining. Little arms. Who doesn't like arms? I mean, you couldn't eat or anything without arms. There. Okay. Now the best part to me, coloring. First you need green for the stem and leaves. So just do that. By the way, um, I'm using Crayola erasable pencils. You don't have to do that. All you need is some colored pencils. You can even use crayons or markers, but I prefer using Crayola. I prefer using Crayola erasable ones because I make mistakes. Who doesn't make mistakes at this? So I like using these because they feel good to me, but you can use crayons, markers, whatever you want to color it. You don't even have to color. You can make it black and white. You can do whatever you want here. So just color it, just color his leaves and his stem. Just, that'll take a little bit. So just do that. Do your best to stay in the lines. Like, right there, look. Not, here, look. Just do dee doo dee doo There, perfect. Nope, it's not ideal. It will never be ideal. Not whoever, 
no matter who does, it's not going to be ideal. But, hmm. Okay, last leaf. There we go. Look at that. He's got colorful hair, I guess. Okay, after that, he kind of goes from a dark pink from his feet to a light pink up here by this leaf. So that's going to be really hard to do because not even I can do perfect stuff like that. But for dark pink, uh, this is my trick. Um, and it never, it doesn't always work, but for me, I think it's pretty helpful. So his feet are kind of like a dark pinkish red. So I do that and then I kind of scrape up. And sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. It will scrape, it won't go lighter. And so you just do in there, just la 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 la. His arms are dark pink, so he looks like a tomato. <laughs> he looks like a tomato to me. Eh, whatever. Tomatoes are good too. I'm not a big fan of tomatoes, but they work. Well, after you get that, probably about half his body red of some sort, you take out the lighter pink or lighter red, and you kind of overlap it like this. You kind of overlap it to where it looks like it's kind of blending into it. Also, you want to color the tongue pink. And then right there, and you don't want to push too hard once you get up to the forehead, so it looks like it's kind of blending in like that. See? See? And then you just sign your name here at the here. Just scrape off, shake it off. There, shake it off. There. Okay. Then you just write your name down here, as fancy as you want it to be. And there, you have your nice little Adam Apple drawing. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, hopefully, I will give you more drawing videos. A lot of them will have to do with Shopkins, but. Uh, I hope you like this video. Please subscribe. Bye.